Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Yashi's Island. We're getting close to the end. Look at the little ghost stone. You see where number seven is with the Yashi? Look at the little drawing of the ghost. Ain't that cute? So we're going to see some more ghosts in this level, which is called the Deep Underground Maze. It sounds deep and underground. So at least it's not an auto-scroller. Hooray and huzzah, etc, etc. Finding secrets, finding secrets. One up, much appreciated. Much appreciated. Oh, I get it. Already solved this puzzle. Already cracked this code, this little mystery. I already know what I'm doing. This is what I'm doing. Yeah, you sit there, you big dummy. God, what a dummy. All right, give me these stars. <coughs> Excuse me. I am professional. Alright, spin, spin, spin. What does this mean? Done. Okie doke. Need a key. Up we go. Key's over there. Oh, I think. Let's get rid of these little tap taps. Oh, you can't get rid of that boy? That not good. But we can still, like, destroy some stuff. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, fuck are you? Dolphin. Oh, I guess he doesn't come with me. That's fine. Probably didn't need him. Probably didn't need him. Uh, could have used him. Didn't. Oh, yeah. Whoa! Big old ghost. Big old flipping ghost right there. What the... What the hat? What the heck? Whoa. It's been so long since I played this game. And the last time I played this game was probably on the uh, the Wii U, I think. Had um, had Yoshi's Island on it. And uh, I do not remember the big ghost. I don't. I don't remember it. But let's go, let's go say hi. Howdy. Oh, he's a shy guy. He's been a silly goof. Been a silly billy. Yes, give me that. Middle ring. Go, go. Down we go. Flying through this, man. Flying through it. So really, after this, there's probably only like two more episodes, depending on how long the finale is. And I imagine it's probably going to be quite long because... Oh, did I fudge something? You goddamn right I did. Ah, oh, fuck it. All right. Well, now I'm down here. Did you see that avoidance? Did you see that avoidance? Why is your tricks now, Fireboy? It's gonna take... Oh, no. What if I do that? Or do that? No. <laughs> no. 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 Don't come after me. I'm Sweet Boy. I, uh... I give you... I give you presents. I've done nothing... To harm, I deserve your attention and love. Aha! What's up? It's a flower and the red coins. Oh, boy, these guys are sneaky. I once again avoided Fireboy. I'm like, you really can't catch me out with that one anymore. But then, um, then they hit me with, like, Karate Masters and shit. I'm like, alright. You guys are playing a different game here. Do not appreciate it. No, sir. Hurts me. It hurts me. Flying through this one, man. What's up here? Oh. This guy again. I don't like how they go to the, the judo well with that guy. Oh, cool. This is where one of the places I wanted to stop. Sweet. Alright, so that was the left. So let's go this way. Let's see what's in here. Probably could have got some stars and shit. Uh, that's the new national anthem for America. <laughs> uh, please rise and give all your attention to, you know, stars and shit. <laughs> I find that funny. I bet any American watching this is going to be like, listen, man, I wouldn't consider myself too patriotic. I wouldn't consider myself to be red blooded American or nothing. But you don't fucking. You don't make fun of the flag. Fuck you, you don't make fun of the flag. 
I'm like, why not? Well, yeah, it's so the one thing that um, Americans and uh, people from Northern Ireland seem to have in common. You don't make fun of the flag. Don't fuck with the flag. Mm -mm. Why? Is it because they're so emotionally distraught that they can't figure out anything else to put all their anger and, like, you know... Uh, hatred towards they can't focus it properly so all they do is just talk about flags because they think if they fix it on flags as like a symbolic thing as a patriotic thing and they prove their patriotic worth via their love for the flag not by doing anything specifically for their country not helping out their country not by doing anything like that but if they express their um, love for their country via flag, um, and they go, well, of course I love, of course I'm a patriot, I love the flag. And I'm like, well, you know, have you, I think people just assume that that's a good way to get points. They're like, well, you know, like, it's very passive. It's like, you haven't done anything for the cause, you know, like people who say they love America because they love the flag, right? And, you know, this could be, you know, um, totally um, applicable to, uh, to Northern Ireland as well. <clears throat> so people who say, oh, I love this country, I love the flag. I'm like, well, what are you doing to help it? You know, and that sounds kind of catty, I guess. But, like, I mean, like, you know, are you trying to champion a lot of the stuff that we need championing? Like, um... Are you are you helping to change the education system or like work in the arts or you know stuff like this? Is this is 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 that on your agenda? Is that on your list? Are you trying to help homelessness? Are you trying to make Northern Ireland a better place? Because that's that that's important to me is like making your own country better. It's it's hollow to just say I love I love the flag. I'm like, well, loving a piece of material is fucking weird, man. You love the Pleas. Um, and if you don't love the Pleas, and you just love the flag, then you're being weird. Like, I find that very funny how patriots don't seem to understand their own, like, patronage. Do you know what I mean? Like, um, I'm sure I can get up there later. Like, um, all these red-blooded Americans who are like, I love the flag, I love it. And they're very, like, they're very, very clear that they love a flag. And they're like, well, that's cool to love a flag. And all. What's down here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, but, like, these are the same people who would be happy to suppress other people and their rights. And they're the people who, like, kind of support Donald Trump. Not to blanket everybody with the same brush, but, like, they, they you know, the kind of people who would, like, support Donald Trump or would be happy for example, to take advantage of their fellow man to get ahead in life, right? I don't think that that's telling any tales out of school. And it's the same thing over here in Northern Ireland. All the people who are, like, patriotic and they're like, we love our flag. I'm like, well, you don't love the flag because part of the problem we have is the people who say they love the flag and they love Northern Ireland and they love the UK and shit... Like, they're not doing other than to, to make a difference or to make it better. They're not, like... Do you know what I mean? Like, they're not... They're not helping the art system that desperately needs um, fixed. Or they're not... Um, aha! They're not helping the homeless problem, which is huge. And, you know, because the, you, you talk to them, you know, you're like, the homeless people need homes too. All those people who are like, we love the flag, are going to be the same people who go, fuck them, you know. They, um... Huh? What? Uh -huh. They're going to be like, we don't need those people. You know, you're probably homeless for a reason, etc, etc. Like, that's the way they talk. And you're like, well, you don't seem to have a good grasp on being a patriot and loving your country. You know, you want to help everybody. You want to help those people. And you want to make the country better place to live. Because that's the point. Um, and if you don't, like, what's the point? Do you know what I mean? Like, 
it seems weird to me to 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 talk about how great this country or or any country is to be very vocal about how great a country is um and your love for it and your support for it and yet have no interest in any of its like social issues or economic issues or, or like things that that need to be changed and um you know, so that's just very strange. So you think about all the people who like rioted about the flag, you know, do they, do they give a pound to like homeless people whenever they see them? Um, have they like stood up and said, no, we need to fix the, the situation when it comes to the arts in Northern Ireland, because I love this flag and I love this country. And I feel like um, artists and people in Northern Ireland are severely underrepresented um, in the media and they deserve the chance to be shown and showcased because they're just as good as the guys in the rest of the UK, but we don't get a chance to show it. Um, no, people who like their flag just say, oh, flag, der. And they use that as a cheap form of like um, of patriotism. You know, and just go, yeah, of course I'm a patriot because I love the flag. I'm like, well, that's hollow. It doesn't mean anything, you know. Anyway, this has been Yoshi's Island. <laughs> Oops. Ooh. Boy, I did not talk about anything funny in this episode at all. I'm very sorry. 74 points. Um, so there we go. We've got two levels left, and one of them is a big old bad. So uh, thanks for watching this episode. Um, appreciate it. Appreciate it. I really do. I am gonna. I'm gonna go love my flag right now. And if you know what I mean, I'm gonna jerk off all over it. But then after that, I'll play some more Yoshi's Island, and you'll see it in the next episode. Thank you. Ah, it's going backwards. All right. Thanks. Whatever. <laughs>